Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Dungeons & Dragons Online, uh, Neverwinter. And on this episode, we're going to be continuing off of the quest that we were doing last time. Uh, the last piece that we need to do is uh, to battle monsters, but I'm joined by two very good friends tonight. Uh, we have Hydra's Inc. with us. What's up, everybody? I'm playing Sinister, my level 60 rogue. And we have Otaku Jesus from the Iron Thorn Guild. Hello, adventurers, and I'm playing Iron Thunder, my level 60 uh, great no, weapon. Good clerics. And uh, we're going to go ahead and zone into this area right here and, uh, you know, kill a couple of the creatures. We need to kill 10 of them, right? Yeah, guys, we're only level 60 because we're in this zone. I think we're all like level 12 or 13 or 14. Oh, look at the monsters, dude. Oh, wow. I'm not doing any damage to these things at all. But he, uh, he definitely. Oh, did you see that? What? They slide on the ice just like you do. Yeah. <laughs> he slid right past me. Don't get me, punk. Try it. Try it. You can't I'm stop as well as I can. Why? Why is that? Every time I got in a fight with them last time he was here, I died instantly. Really? Oh, yeah. I'm going to stick with Iron Thunder, guys, because me and him together, we can flank, we make a really good team, and uh, wow. AC is healing the crap out of us, too, so that's freaking awesome. Yeah, Lord of Fate is out here, and I don't know if that's another player or what, but he is just whacking these things once or twice. And they die. Oh, that's his pet. We should follow that guy. I don't want to follow that guy. I want to make my own path. Oh, right. God. Cut my own path. Right? Oh. Let's see how well you guys do in here. I cannot stand, stand still. I hate the ice. Yeah. It's there we go. Like ass. Okay, no. which one is uh, I like Iron Thunder? This. Okay, Iron Thunder's on that guy. So let me make sure I'm on him. Yeah, he's dying fast. Me and Iron Thunder, we got this. Oh, you can't oh handle my this, god, the damage is building up, sir. Nice. Uh, I feel like crab cakes for dinner, guys. Okay, Demiro's got one on him, so let's go help out him. That's right, I'll knock it back here in a second. Oh my god, I love my rogue. Boom, baby. Oh yeah, um, I love it when you stun those things. I hate when it happens to you when you do PvP and uh, they just wreck your face, man. Alright, let's get on this uh, shrieking ghost. Oh, we got a few. At me and I, I don't like confrontation. Let's move a little closer, guys. That way I can use my area effect spell. Oh, these are Glabrazoos, dude. These are demons, dude. Very cool. Very cool. That's exactly how they look, too, man. I love you, guys. Oh, God, I'm going to die. Yeah, get, get back over here, guys. Oh, this is unfortunate, guys. It's going to be it's gonna be painful. Jeez. Yeah, they are wiping okay. the floor with me over here. Oh, yeah, let's help back me, up, AC. Back You're up. my only hope. Help me, everyone. <laughs> oh, he's all over me. Oh, oh, he slid right past me, guys. Wow. Use it. There we go. Get out of here. Oh, no. Oh, man. I am going to die. I'm going to die. Let me out of here. Me. Shift one, guys. Help me. I'm running. I'm running. Oh, I'm calling for help. Help. Oh, jeez. Oh, let me die. Jeez, that is rough, man. <laughs> I'll be revived. Uh, is complete. We actually did it. Uh. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Well, I, I died I doing it, but uh... <laughs> got a score eight. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> the Who other guy told you. 116. Holy that's, crap. That's why I said we should have stayed with that guy because he knew what he was doing, man. Let me go oh, ahead. I gotta and get out of here. Where you guys at? Oh, you guys are leaving me. Yeah, we came back over here. I'm, I'm gonna sit here and get uh, healed up. I'm actually uh, pretty injured. What about you guys? Oh, dude, I'm, I'm hurting for certain. Pretty soon the blood's going to start squirting. <laughs> I got I'm a minor fine. leg injury right there. Reduces your running speed by a moderate amount, which is the last thing you want to do when you go into a PvP is go in there with uh, something like that. So I'm going to sit oh, here and brutal. get healed up. Yeah, that was, that was pretty rough. Now, for mm. those of you who uh, may not know, you can stand here in the fire and you can accept your little, uh, what, what do you call those, a little daily... Uh, Invocations. Yeah. You can do up to 14 of them a day. If you walk outside this little area, you can no longer access that, but you can do that. Also, something we really haven't mentioned is going up to your professions. Just hit the P on the, the keyboard or go up to the very top of the screen where there's a little hammer and click on that. This gives you not only gold, but it also gives you money. A lot of different uh, things in that, in that sense. Ataku, you were letting us know that you've actually done this on your main. Can you tell us a little bit about it and maybe some of the stuff you got out of it? Well, no, I'm actually doing it on this one, and I'm trying to get to where I can make coal so I can make weapon heads. 
Oh, and what kind of weapons are you hoping to make? I'm hoping to make axes. What, what skill? What skill are you going down? Are you going down like all of them equally, or are you basically just doing... the metal smithing, weapon smithing, mail smithing, and plate smithing? Oh, okay. So you're not concentrating you know on all of them then? No. Okay. Yeah, there's uh, weapon smithing, tailoring, plate smithing, mail smithing, weather, leather working, jewel crafting, uh, artifact, artificing, uh, alchemy, uh, light crafting, leadership, which is what I've gone down uh, for primar primarily, as well as uh, black ice shaping. And I don't know what pretty much any of these things do, but they're very cool because they give you experience. Uh, they're, they are progressed while you're offline. So you can do like the really long ones right before you call it a night. Uh, some of these are really short, as you can see, they do 15 minutes. Uh, some of them are really long, five hours. I think the longest I've seen so far is 12 hours. So yeah, just make sure that you do the short ones, the 10 minute ones while you're on, and that goes by pretty quick. Then when you're about to log off for the night, do the six hour, seven hour, you know, those kind of ones. And that way when you log back on, you got a nice little reward sitting there waiting for you. And I leveled just logging on today from getting those things. So. Uh, definitely worthwhile. What about you guys? I think I'm gonna do weapon smithing, jewel crafting, and leather working because I don't think rogues can wear plate or mail or anything like that. So, yeah. Is is the stuff you make though uh, no trade, or can you sell it in the the, the bazaar or wherever later on down the road? I I think you can sell it and trade it. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so guys. I'm gonna go turn into the mayor. I was. Do you guys need to turn in the mayor as well? Yes, we do. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna wait on the guys to get over here. But yeah, man, the profession seems to be cool. I was trying to work them all, but I guess uh, Taku's got a point there. You should really only be working the ones that are beneficial to your character. Uh, I don't need plate mail. I don't need mail smithing because my character will never be able to. But and, uh, if you can make that stuff and sell it to other characters, that might actually be beneficial. So yeah, and it gives but, you experience. So if you're not doing the really long ones, you might be able to level a little faster. All right, so let's talk to Mayor Vario Sefi. I hope you've enjoyed the festivities okay, tonight. Feel free complete. to continue the celebration and win more rewards. You can also return tomorrow for another night of revelry under the starry sky. Not bad, not bad, guys. I got 142 experience, 22 copper, and 5 of those lights. I got 158 experience, 24 copper, and 5 lights as well. So let's complete the quest. Alright, so we got... Three uh, ones that similar celebration. You can set this quest in four hours. So we can't do that one again, guys. But we can do all of the stars, similar crafts, and far from home. But uh, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode, guys. Basically, what we're doing is we're waiting for the PvP to start. We're in the the, the queue for it, and as soon as that gets going, we're gonna do another one of those. We actually all like those. We're just we're trying to figure them out. We're trying to figure out what the best tactics are. If you're at home watching and you've done a number of those things, and you want to give us some helpful hints to give us, uh, you know, just a leg up on the competition, i definitely leave those comments down below. Also, is it uh, dependent on our level or armor? I think you said the last time we zoned in, uh, we automatically got leveled up to level 19, right? Yeah, it says it's got a level, it's a level 10 through 19, and so I think it automatically boosts us to the top of that sca uh, scale. Yeah, I, th I agree. So that way we're all slightly on equal footing, yeah. Yeah, yeah but we don't... We don't necessarily have the uh, skill points you get at level 19, nor do we have the equipment the you would have, yeah. So that does make a little bit of a uh, an impact, I'm sure, on the gameplay for people who are going in there exactly at level 19. They could probably wreck the, the place with, uh, you know, even though they're, you know, kind of scaled up. But, uh, yeah, we would still love to learn the tactics. I think, uh, you know, primarily, in my opinion, the best thing to do would be to uh, have somebody in the background distracting the other guys. Uh, because if you have all five people rushing against you, that's a pretty hard fight to win. But if you can separate one or two people and distract them, and there you go right there, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and join, and we're going to end this episode now. And we'll see you guys in a few minutes. Subscribe. Oh, crap. Bye-bye.